What's up guys and welcome to another video. Right, so after a week, my Barbie of controller has finally come. A week is not too bad to be honest. I mean, if I did customize it to the max, it would have taken a lot longer and that's not what I wanted to do. I just wanted a basic controller with the features that I wanted. So there's actually two options you can go for when it comes to the quick pick controllers. You can get the basic pick, which is just a bit, which is just a basic DualShock 4 controller with a range of colors. The only thing is it has buttons on the back. But for the Pro Pick, it's the same. Stock DualShock 4 controller, range of colors, buttons on the back, but it has digital tap bumpers and triggers or smart bumpers and triggers, whatever you want to call it. So that's the feature that I wanted since I've not got that yet with any of my Pro controllers. Of course, with the Custom Mods UK one that I've got, it's got everything I want, buttons on the back, it looks nice, but the triggers and bumpers, they don't have any digital tap ones. I do wish that company did have that, and I do hope to do it in the future, but in this case, it didn't, so I thought I'd look elsewhere. The only companies I know that do it are Scuff, of course, Battle B Customs, and AIM. I know there's a lot of other companies out there, but those are the only three that I know. Um, so again, with Scuff, way too expensive, so I wasn't even gonna go there with them. With AIM, I was gonna go for them. The only thing is, when it comes to pro controllers, I prefer back buttons to back, to back paddles, just because it just feels more comfy in the hand and it's more convenient in the hand, instead of having to like stick your fingers out where the paddles are. I think you can actually take them off and have buttons instead of paddles, but I just thought I'd go for Battle Beaver because they had a lot more um, good reviews than bad reviews. I don't think I've heard any bad review about Battle Beaver, so I thought I'd go safe with them. So, without further ado, let's get straight to it. I don't even know why I tried using scissors, but hey ho. I saw 90s one hand, I definitely need a tripod. Comes in a basic PlayStation box, of course. I expected that. Got the Barbie sticker on there. And this is how it looks. Oh. Yeah, I just got a basic red colour, just because it goes with my actual console. My PS4 console is the amazing red edition, you know, Spider-Man one that came out with the Spider-Man game, like two years ago, I think he was. Yeah, I got that version, so it goes really well with my console itself, so I thought, yeah, hey, I'll go with red, why not? Battle Beaver. Business card. And then uh, here, it actually states what everything is mapped to and all the good stuff. Took the rumbles out of it, so it's lighter. Yep, shows all that good stuff there. Now let's get into opening this baby up. Yep, yeah, looks definitely like the controller that came with my console, except for, of course, the square, triangle, circle, X buttons, analog sticks, and the D-pad, since on the actual one that comes with the PlayStation it is white and red. Yep, yeah, so, 
It's got a battle beaver sticker right there so that you can't take it apart. Yep, feels good. I just wanted to make sure there was no stiff buttons or anything. Back buttons right there. It's a bit similar to the custom mods back buttons. Just a bit louder and clickier. I like it. Right, so the moment of truth. This is what I've been waiting for. The digital tap bumpers and triggers. Let's see how it sounds. Oh wow. That's literally a mouse kick click. That is literally a mouse click. It's very light since the rumble's been taken out. I can't get over. I wasn't expecting it to be so clicky. I knew, because I've seen videos of it, I knew what it was like, but I honestly didn't think it would be like this. I thought it would still have a bit of press to it, but literally it's just a little mouse click. I can imagine it's being really, really effective in Call of Duty or any FPS games in general. Let's try the other side. Wow. I need to get a ma I need to get a mouse just so I can compare it. Okay, so I got a mouse. Listen to this. And now the controller. It's literally the same. That is definitely a mouse click. This one is a bit lower than that one. This one sounds higher, but it's practically the same. Listen to this part, triggers. It's practically the same. It feels the same. I honestly could not wait to play Call of Duty on this. I can't get enough of it. <laughs> Back buttons sound solid. Yeah, this is a really good controller. Solid controller right here. Basic red color to go with my console. And that is pretty much everything. So this is the Barbie the Customs Pro Pick controller. Standard controller in red, standard DualShock 4 controller with digital tap bumpers and triggers and back buttons. If you're interested in getting one of these, I will put a link in the description. But this has been it from me, Warrior J, and this has been the way, the Warrior's way. Peace out. Thank <laughs> you.